SprintCarUnlimited.com coming from Port Royal Speedway. We're here with winner Devin Borden. Uh, Devin, it's got to feel good to get a win, especially last week after last week uh, losing it late to Danny Dietrich. And ironically, you got him back tonight with a couple to go. So uh, this has got to be satisfying. No doubt. Yeah, this feels super good. And you know, secret, we've been a little off beginning of this year and it just feels super good, super good to get the monkey off my back and um, get the first win of the year. And like you said, last week we were pretty damn close to it. Dietrich got us and uh, we were able to get him back this week. So, uh, you know, it's always fun racing with him. Race, we, we race each other super clean and, um, you know, clean and hard and we're always battling. So um, lots of fun racing with him and I was just happy we were able to end up on top tonight. You started 12th on the grid, unlike yeah. last week you were up front. I mean, I when you roll out like that, what are you thinking? It wasn't a daytime surface till right. till night fell, but still right. tough to come from 12th. Yeah, no doubt. I mean, any of these races coming from 12th, it's freaking hard. I mean, everyone's very good, you know? I mean, there ain't really no slouches in that top 12. So um, you just got to be better than everybody. So um, luckily, you know, Chris... Chris had the super tune on the race car tonight, and um, we were able to be really good. And um, I knew once they wanted that top, that uh, I was going to play in our favor for sure, you know. Um, and it definitely did. I was just run pretty much wide open right against that fence, and uh, that's usually where we make our speed around here. Well, you did. You get up to second, and the lap cars didn't do you any favors. No. You had some guys in your way, but I thought you remained patient and didn't panic. I think it's one of the most patient races I've seen you yeah. run. You could have, you followed Danny for a while, yeah. you lost ground, gained ground, but just kind of waited for that right time. Yeah. Uh, is that something that Chris has kind of helped you realize, hey, I gotta be patient, don't pull the trigger and right. do something stupid or lose a bunch of ground? Yeah, definitely. I mean, Chris is helping me a lot in that aspect of things too, but a lot of it is I'm just kind of realizing sometimes I need to settle down and not be so extremely aggressive, you know, and. I'm just trying to work on that, and I feel like I'm getting better at that. I think you're right. Like, that race, there's multiple times I could have pulled the trigger and maybe got him and maybe wrecked and maybe lost ground. Like, and I knew we, I knew we had a really fast race car, so I knew I was just better just to stay patient and wait for the right time, and that's what I did. Danny went to the bottom. Yeah. You had Your eyes probably got really big when he went to the bottom in three and four because... Yeah, <laughs> that, that was like a Christmas present there. <laughs> and then you were able to get him, I think, on lap 23, slide by yeah. by a little bit. He got back by you right. again on 24 in one and two. Then you got yep. back by him in on the top of, <laughs> of three, three and four. four. Yep. But still had to had to shut it down that last lap. And, yeah. and he took one last shot in turn four. Right. What were you thinking going in the final two corners? Uh, honestly, the final two corners I wasn't as worried about. It was it was the lap before that. I knew that once I got to the top, um, especially in three and four, because that's where we, we were the fastest, was around the fence in three and four. And uh, I knew once I got through one and two, I was pretty much going to be smooth sailing because the top, we were obviously so fast. And I, did, I figured he wasn't quite going to be able to carry enough momentum to slide me or, or pass me on the bottom. So. Um, that last lap, I wasn't as concerned as I was a lot before that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's this mean to this team? First win with Chris Shuttlesworth as yep. crew chief. Uh, you know, it seems like you guys are starting to hit your stride a little bit here. Right. Had a couple good runs last week and then get right. the win tonight. Yeah, definitely. You know, like I said, we didn't start out the year how we wanted to, that's for sure. And uh, a lot of it's just bad pill draws, freaking things just not going our way, you know. Wheel covers breaking, this, that, like just – stupid shit happening and um yeah i mean i feel like things are finally starting to go our way and uh that's what it takes to win these races got to feel good going into uh fabs tomorrow and and really yeah. the rest of the season yeah definitely um we're gonna do everything we can to freaking sweep the weekend <laughs> congratulations on the win yeah thank you sprintcarunlimited.com coming from port Royal speedway with race winner devin borden